What's up, math scholars and math haters? This is Mr. W. Today we're going to tackle question 22 in the Math 1 questions that North Carolina released this past school year. This question tells us that a club began with three members, and each month each member brought one new member. And we're trying to figure out the function that can be used to determine the number of members x months after the club began. Now this is going to deal with exponential functions specifically translating word problems to exponential functions. Now, what does an exponential function mean? Well, an exponential function means that to get from one value of x to the next one, we multiply by the same thing every time. So if I actually look at the wording of this problem, I can uh, demonstrate that. If we start with three members, and if this is x months after the club began, my x would be zero. So it's zero months my f, my number of members, is 3. If it's one month, every member's brought another new member, so 3 times 2 would give me 6 members now. After 2 months, x is 2. If 6 members each brought one member, that's 12. x is 3. And 12 times 2, if each member brings one new one, that's 12 times 2, which is 24. So I think this is a good set of x and y values to go along with for right now. First thing I want to do is confirm what might be some of your suspicions at this point. Because if you know about linear functions, you know that we're not multiplying the same thing every time to get from one value of f to the next. We're adding the same thing. And it doesn't look like we're adding the same thing here. We're adding 3, adding 6, adding 12. So both of our linear equation choices, or linear function choices, are out. So that leaves us with just either choice C or choice D. It's either 1 and a half times 2 to the x, or 3 times 2 to the x. And it's at this point that the easiest way to solve this, and narrow it down between choice C and choice D, is to think about what it means to raise something to the zero power. Because 1.5 times 2 to the 0 and 3 times 2 to the 0 will give us different answers. And that will actually lead us to determine what the correct answer choice is between C and D. Now to raise something to the 0 power, as long as your base isn't 0, anything to the 0 power equals 1. So 1.5 times 2 to the 0 is the same thing as 1.5 times 1, which is just 1.5, not what we were expecting given the numbers that we actually went ahead and figured out. But let's try it with choice D. 2 to the 0 is 1. So 3 times 2 to the 0 is the same thing as 3 times 1, which is 3. This is what we were expecting, because when the club first began, there were three members, not one and a half members. I don't think you can really have half a member of something. But either way, using these properties of exponential functions, and translating this word problem, our best answer is choice D.